What's up, my YouTube fam? You looking for a good hot honey mustard sauce to slather up on some chicken? Look no more. Let me show you how easy it is. Hello, my YouTube family. Today, we are going to make some hot honey mustard chicken strips. Simple, easy as one, two, three. Let's start to trim off this excess fat off of our chicken breast. And then we are gonna cut this into strips. Let's get this piece off. Cause this piece is always funky at the end. Look at that. Just throw the whole, throw this whole part away. We don't need it. Okay, so I could probably get, I'm thinking maybe six strips out of here. So we are going to slice this bad boy down the middle. Just like this. And we are going to start cutting these into strips like this. Now when you make a good wing sauce, you do not always have to use chicken wings. You can use breast, cut them into strips. You can use legs, thighs. It don't just have to be on chicken wings. Wait until you see how good these come out. Okay, so let's see how many strips we made. So I'm not making a lot because I'm the only one eating them. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Perfect. So we got eight. Let me see. I see a little bit more. See, all that stuff got to go. That has to go. Okay. So now you have your beautiful strip. Should I cut this in half too? No, I'm going to keep them long like this. I'm going to keep them long. Okay, so now we want to take our strips, transfer them to our bowl for marination. Let's get this out the way. Now, what I'm going to do is keep the seasonings nice and light because the sauce is going to be packing flavor. So we are using a little bit of Larry's seasoning sauce. Just a little. And I'm also going to use some kicking chicken seasoning. Just like that. And we are going to use some regular degular mustard, just a little bit. Booyah. Take your hands, mix it up. Get all your chicken coated. Get it all coated. And remember to season light because you're gonna be using salted butter. And then your honey mustard sauce is gonna have a lot of sodium in it as well. So here is my chicken strips. I'm gonna let these sit in this mustard for maybe about 20 to 30 minutes and I'll be back to coat them and drop them in the grease. Okay, you guys, I am back. Now it is time to bread up our chicken tenders. And we are going to start by dipping them in all-purpose flour. I added a little bit of kicking chicken season into these just to give that um, flour a little bit more flavor. I also added some kicking chicken to this is egg and uh, milk. This is egg and milk and all-purpose flour. So I dipped it in the flour. Now I'm going to dip it in the milk. Let that drain off and now we're going to dip it back in the flour and use our dry hand to coat that up. Okay. 
Okay. And I'm just going to repeat the process and get all my strips nice and breaded, just like this. And I will be back. Yeah, so here is my beautiful breaded chicken strips. And they are ready for the hot oil. Let's get to dropping those in. So these are very thin, not thick at all. So we are going to fry these probably for about fifth, no, about, I would probably say about eight to 10 minutes. So we're gonna let these babies fry and then I will be back to start that sauce for y'all. Look at our beautiful, crispy, brown, golden, seasoned chicken strips. Let's sauce these bad boys up. Okay, you guys, it is time to make our beautiful, hot, honey mustard sauce. So I am starting with four tablespoons of butter, basically a half a stick of butter. And we are gonna get this nice and melted up. Hope everyone is having a beautiful day today. If you are new to the channel, please do not forget to subscribe also, like, comment, and share. I really, really appreciate it more than you know. All my original subscribers, I always thank you guys for coming back and watching your girl chef it up. All right. Now, this is one of the recipes that you guys voted for. I put up a poll on the uh, community tab, and you guys said you wanted to see the hot honey mustard, but I am still going to do for you guys that Korean honey butter recipe, because listen, that Korean honey butter is a bomb, so I definitely have to do that for you guys. Okay, so our butter is getting nice and melty, now let's go in with some mustard, this is going to go really quick, so I am using... Dijon mustard okay so we are using Dijon mustard put that right in the pan I have no idea how much that was if I had to guess you guys I would probably say one fourth cup I am going in with some Frank's Red Hot of course Frank's Red Hot come on now so we going in with some Frank's Red Hot not too much of that Okay, let's give it a stir. Let's actually turn down our fire to low. There we go. So let's give this a stir. Give it a whirl, give it a whirl. Okay. Next, you guys, let's go in with some honey. Of course, because we are having just regular honey. Regular honey. Because we are having hot honey mustard, right? So, of course, we need honey. This one is just about empty. I am going to trash that. I got another one right here. Boom, boom, boom. There we go. Honey, baby. Yes. Okay. Next, we are going to go in with a little bit of seasoning. Let's add in a little bit of black pepper. Because y'all know I'm all about the flavors. You thought we were just going to have hot sauce and honey and mustard? No. Season your food. Okay. We are going to go in with some kicking chicken. Because I love this because it has those red pepper flakes in there. And all that good seasoning up in there. That's going to give it a nice kick. Okay. Oh, y'all. 
Next, we are going to go in with some honey hickory seasoning. Good stuff. Good stuff. Good stuff. Booyah. And we are going to go in with some Hungarian style. There you go. Sweet paprika. I don't know if you guys can see that. There you go. Sweet paprika. This is just going to give it that. Ooh, buddy. Look at that. Sweet paprika. My lord. It smells so good. And lastly, we are going in with some parsley for a pretty color. Parsley. And last, but certainly not least, we are going in with a little bit of brown sugar. Boom, boom. Let's give this a nice stir. Then what I'm going to do is taste this sauce and see if it has that kick to it. Because I know it has that sweetness to it, but I want it to have that, you know, that spice, that heat too. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So let's give this a taste. Let me grab a spoon. And let's see. Oh yeah, the kick is in there. Oh yeah. Oh, that's good stuff. I'm gonna let this simmer off for uh, another minute, and then we go add in our chicken. We go crank that heat up a little bit. Let that chicken swim up in that sauce, and we go plate it up and we go eat. Let's get our chicken over here. Hope you guys can get a good view of this sauce. It's good. Mm -hmm. Let that simmer up. Oh, that Dijon mustard just gives it a different kind of twang to me, too. They give it a whole different kind of twang. Okay, now. Let's add in our chicken. How easy is this? I swear, cooking is so fun. Do not make cooking hard. Cooking is so fun. This was so easy. This is, Look at all this chicken from one chicken breast, y'all. Look how many strips I made from one chicken breast. So now, I want to crank this heat up a little bit. Crank it up a little bit. And... Let's get these bad boys a nice toss. Just try not to make a mess like I'm doing. I'm just excited. I'm ready to dip these bad boys. I'm ready to eat. Because that sauce tastes so good. And this chicken is just fried to perfection. Let me tell you. Oh yeah. Mm hmm Yep. Where are you going? Uh-uh. He trying to act like he ain't wanna get all sauced up in the back there. Come on now. Okay, you guys, so I am going to finish tossing these up. And look at that, it was just the right amount of sauce. And I just eyeballed it, y'all. I know I need to start giving y'all measurements, but I just I you know all my white, I just make, I don't do measurements. I just eyeball everything. But this is the perfect amount of sauce. Look at that. I am ready to plate these bad boys up. Yes. Okay, guys, I'll be back to show you guys the finished product. And here is the finished product, you guys. Nice and sweet and spicy hot honey mustard chicken strips. 
pair it with some carrots or some celery. I got some blue cheese on the side. These are fantastic because I already snuck and tasted one. Hope you guys enjoyed this uh, recipe today. I love you all. And again, do not forget to subscribe if you have not already. I would really appreciate it. Everybody stay safe and stay blessed. Thank you.